Okay guys, today I'm going to be showing you a tutorial in this free program called LMMS on how to compose music and stuff. I mean, yes I know that RPG Freaks, that's my YouTube thing. Anyway, you, some of you might be wondering, oh what does uh, making music have to do with RPGs? role-playing games for those newbies out there because I know there are some out there well anyway let's just say good video games also have to have good music okay so I'll show you a quick tutorial run you through the basics and then uh, maybe even show you some of the stuff I made okay let's jump right into this first off this is how uh, your screen's gonna look when you first open up the stuff. You see over here, this is a uh, automatic track. You just click on it. It won't do anything right now, but once you actually play some stuff, this controls the volume. So if you want to fade in and then like really fade, like really make it loud and then oh, make it really soft. Yeah, you can play around with that if you want. I don't usually use it, but that's just me. And then, uh, let's go a little, these are the plugins, and, uh, Bit Invader is one of my favorites. It sounds kind of cool. This is the p piano roll, and what you do to open it is you one-click, I don't need that, and then you double-click on that. But anyway, just to show you a bit better, this is Play It. So, in case if you actually have something there, this is record, erase, which you just click, or you can just left click, see, and the erase symbol goes on. Anyway, let me just show you a quick thing. You guys can't hear it right now. Basically, you hit the record, and uh, you press your keys on your pad and it makes different notes and you can hold them maybe not want to hold them and then hit play it plays back sorry guys about the volume I, I've been having issues with it so you won't be able to hear exactly what I make I hope that doesn't really affect this video but if it does sorry there's nothing I can do nothing you guys can do well there's something I could do but I don't feel like spending money uh, this are samples so it's like pre-made stuff and that those are beats and stuff drums you know there's a clap you can't hear it once again but if you drag it over here this over here is kind of like fruity loops and you can just click so you don't have to use the piano roll and then hit play but then you then you match it up and then drag, see how long you want it. And then anyway, default preset. This is just like a regular thing. But what you can do is you can mess around with the switches to make it sound different. And if you don't know what all these mean, I don't feel like going through it because there's a lot of them. But basically, just play around with it. That actually sounds kind of cool. Uh, and then, uh, if you left click, it puts one of these notes, and then you can drag to see how long you want it. And then, that's just something right there that I made. It took like five seconds. And then, you can hear it all together, but obviously you guys can't. So this adds a new sample track, this adds new bass, and then see everything over here is reset. But then if you go back, there's what we had before, or at least I had, I don't know what you guys had, but yeah. I don't need this anymore. And then you can add a new audio, auto on track. Uh, anyway, back to over here, here's... Uh, these are the presets that I 
made, well, these two, and that one, but then the rest, uh, just came with my software anyway, and then over here is my home where you can go desktop and all that stuff, uh, what else was I going to show you? No, or the, oh, here we go, uh, right here is, uh, the different projects, this is actually one of my projects that I made, I should have put it in one of the folders, um, then these are pre-made songs, you can just click on them if you need inspiration or anything, but pretty much it's pretty basic software. I mean, you don't have to be good at the pianos, you don't have to press the keys, you can just randomly press the right click thing, and then make something like this. Watch out though, it's gonna sound really bad. Uh, well at least you guys can't hear it. That actually didn't sound too bad, but, oh well. And that's pretty much the rundown of the basics. Yeah, I know. I should probably end it before I get all into it. Uh, that's it, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, bye.